Lake Tahoe locals will tell you this is turning out to be one of the busiest summers they've ever seen. I think around here it kind of feels like the 4th of July every day or every weekend. But along with more people comes more trash and locals say they're fed up with it. I feel like the locals here kind of have like a sense of respect just because this is our home and we feel very passionate about wanting to keep like the lake very pristine. I don't blame them. Everybody should pick up their trash. We always do, you know. I always bring trash bags and take them back. But not everyone does. These pictures show the piles of trash left behind after recent busy weekends, enough to encourage locals to rally together with a plea for city leaders and a message for tourists. It's not that we don't want you here. We just want you to understand there's a certain level of responsibility when you come up here. That's the same message the Tahoe Regional Planning Agency, or TRPA, has been pushing for years. They say with Tahoe being made up of two states and four counties, changing the rules when it comes to tourism isn't quite that easy. And we feel the frustration and the compassion that's coming out of these protesters. We understand how everybody feels, and we hope that we can find a more positive outlet. Aside from the trash, rally participants say with so much shut down, why is Tahoe inviting more visitors to come? If no schools are open, how come there's so many people here at a record number when we're only operating at maybe a third of what Tahoe can handle? Now this group says they wanted to be out here on a Friday night because this is when the largest number of tourists are coming into town and they really want to get the message across, not just to city leaders, but also to tourists. So as a result, they're also planning on being back out here Sunday morning when many of these tourists are heading home. In Myers, Kristen Smos, KCRA 3 News.